Oh, we got to talk about the steering wheel. They said it too. couldn't be done. They said it wouldn't Wrong. last. White Wrong. man, Wrong. black man. America F1. America F1 coming to you straight from San Francisco, California. Sherman Tillman, Michael Lawler. America F1. Testing, 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 and more testing. We just completed day two of testing. Welcome, everybody, to America F1. I'd like to congratulate the 2024 champions, uh, the Red Bull team and Max Verstappen. <laughs> it's, 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 I, I'm predicting they're going to win all the races uh, this year. By all like, the races. By like a lot. All the races. All the races. I predict they're going to be 25 seconds ahead at the first race. Oh, you're nuts. 30 seconds you're ahead nuts. at the third race. Get out of here. That's my prediction. And I'm, remember, remember I said this last year? What happened? What oh, happened last they year? They won all the races it but happened. one. And the only reason they won that race is because they was a ho- hoopty street circuit and they couldn't hook that car up for some reason. Well, maybe they'll have some... Let, let's take care of the business before we get into What's it. What's the business? The business. Like, subscribe, comment, and, you know, we have a link tree getting set up. We have a buy me a coffee. If you just bought us one coffee a month, just one coffee a month... We get to go month, to a race. We get to go to races and we get to see more content and we'll get to we'll get to interview everybody if you like our channel or if you're new to our channel tell your friends tell your co-workers buy us a coffee a month because what do we get for a coffee a month well if if we get at least 100 or 200 people buying us a coffee a month Mm. then that helps with the revenue of all the costs that is going into our new studio because we do it for you the fans the fans okay let's get let's get to it f1 testing day two the fastest time is today was carlos Sainz. so the second fastest was lewis hamilton lewis hamilton was second yeah what was his lap time one third i think they had the 131s and the 130s and the 129s Yesterday was 131. Today was 129. They had three teams that beat the pole position from last year, which is good, which was obviously Red Bull, McLaren, but it also said that it was um, like Aston Martin. Wasn't Definitely wasn't Mercedes. I'll tell you that. Mm-hmm. But We're who's on, in front? Who's in front right now, oh, Mike? Let, let's hear it. Who, who do you think is in front? Who has the best livery on track? Because they okay. look a lot different on mm-hmm. track than they do... You know, when they're... Oh, well, they well, have we'll, we'll start off with the 2024 World Champions, the okay. Red Bull team. They've, right. they've already won the championship. I mean... Done. Basically, they just have to show up to the races and they're going to win by a lot. Okay. I th- I'm i not sure about what's going on with the Mercedes team. Are they sandbagging? I can't imagine them sandbagging at a three-day test before a 24-race season. I just... I don't really buy into that. I don't yeah. know. But I know George was yesterday. He was just doing long runs. So he mm-hmm. never did a... Heavy fuel. He never did a, a fastest lap, and he was way off of of her stupids. He put a thirty one some thirty one four down yesterday. But I don't even know. You don't even know if the engines are turned up. You don't know what the hell they're doing. Well, I know yesterday, Mercedes was a whole second. Off no, they the were pace. they were almost four seconds off the pace. Off the pace. Well, I think when they got to the C three tire, they were maybe only a second and a half. I don't off think the they pace. put a set of the reds on, did they? They did. They did. Well, today I know they did, or uh, last night I would say. On F, on did F- Lewis put a set of reds on today? He did, but you said he came in. He only was on second to the. He was in second to yeah, the Ferrari, who I don't Ferrari. think the Ferrari car is very good. You don't. Mm-mm. It's wobbling around too much coming off the corner. You can't have a a twitchy rear end, which is the reason why. Yeah, but they can fix that. You nah. got day of. What <laughs> you, are can't doing? Fi- you can't fix the. Okay, the, the thing about Formula One is the car you show up at testing with is basically what you're stuck with for the whole year. Okay. And I think the the Ferrari is a dog. Are, are already out of the box. I'm not so sure about the Red Bull. I mean, I'm not so sure about the Mercedes because I don't know what they're up to. Uh huh. Um, give me it, give me your top five. Um. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna give you my top one is Red Bull. Yeah. And then it's it's Mercedes. Okay, I don't agree. Ferrari with that. or McLaren are going to be the second or th- they're going to be the top of the mid pack or the top of the front. I, mean, I see Red Bull. Then I see McLaren, then I see Ferrari, then I see Aston Martin, then I see Mercedes. 
That's what I, I'm thinking right now. I don't Just think right so. off the top I of my head. I don't think Mercedes. I love that car, though. That's a good looking. That's the best looking car. I thought the Hulk, Hulk livery looked the best. Kick, Sauber, no, he's F1. Not, he's not, no, he's on top. Right? No. The Hulk, the neon green. Oh, the neon green, yeah. That yeah. looked awesome. Yeah, nice. Right. Oh. Like, I can only imagine in Singapore and in Vegas, that car I is going to look... that whole car green and everything was white. That would be, that would be amazing. But, it, but still, it stood out on track at night and it stood out on track in the day. If and I'm the, ranking the, the liveries... The, fr- gonna, the photographers love that car well, already. They keep... They, uh, Ken Illman's one of the guys on... Has a, uh, all right, I'm going to geek out right now. Mm-hmm. I'm going to totally geek out. Oh, shit, I'm geeking know. out. There were a couple shots yesterday... Where I literally was like, oh, oh, give me, buy me a beer and rub my back. Oh, shit, oh, shit. <laughs> it was, they had one, the, the Alpine at night looked really good. At night. They had this one shot. The Alpine? Yes. Now listen, I'm, no, listen. listen. Uh, was it in the pink or the blue leather? We're right? talking about the BWP, correct? Uh, uh. All right. There was one scene where they were changing tires, okay? Mm-hmm. And it was kind of like dust scene. And you know how the Alpine has like this green stripe on, on the rim. So the gun lit up the stripe <laughs> and it turned like neon green. And then it had a red hue in it. Like I guess it was a red when they started putting the gun on. And then it turned green, which means go, I guess. So well, the, the person putting on the tire can actually know that, okay, it's on, the nut's on. And that shot with the glowing green, just with the tire, looked mm-hmm. really awesome. The well, other really geeky thing was uh-huh. they have the titanium skids on the Mercedes. Yeah. And it was going over this little crest, and all the titanium sparks were flying up into the air. And I was like... Well, that's the only reason they put that titanium oh, on there. Scott kept asking me, he's like, why'd they put titanium so on there? So it would, put, it would put on a show. It that was the whole so point. good. But anyways, the best, the best livery, in my opinion, so far is... It goes Mercedes. Uh, the Ferrari livery is amazing. I wish it was it shiny is. red, it but it's not. And of course, the the steak F one is pretty good. And the rest of them are. I like the Aston Martin, but it won't. It doesn't look good. In, doesn't at look night. good at night. No, no. But the rest of the cars are like average, in my opinion. The Alpine looked good at night too. Nah, actually. it's too much it black on that car. Yeah. I wish they just painted pink, like for the BWT colors. I love when the uh, Racing Point was pink. I was just a cool, cool looking car. But anyways, what are we talking about next? Well, oh, I want to talk about steering wheels. Go ahead. Two teams have brand new steering wheels on their car this year, which makes no sense. Okay. The the Williams has a brand new steering wheel, and it looks a, a little a bit... brand new steering wheel. It looks a little bit like the Mercedes steering wheel, but it's their own design because it's got a V to it. Okay. I sent it to you last night. Yes, uh, yes, I saw it. And then the Sauber has a new steering wheel, which is very strange because they've been running the Ferrari steering wheels for the last few years. Because they have a Ferrari engine in it and a Ferrari gearbox. Um, so you're saying they're making their own steering wheels now? It makes no sense to me. No, no, no. The, the Williams steering wheel has been the same since 2014. And I think since 2014, the Sauber steering wheel has been just hand-me-downs from the okay. Ferrari's last year's uh, steering wheels. So I have a question. Now that we've kind of covered what cars do we think are at the leading of the pack which uh-huh. is pretty much the same from last year when you really think about it uh-huh. i mean the mclaren was off the pace in the beginning of the year but they obviously came on yeah because like they changed the tires halfway in, through the season in austria but it's the same teams up at the front but you know what other team that looked good actually not only did the livery look good but their pace looked good was cash app welcome well, back carter r&b <laughs> You mean you mean the Toro Rosa? Let's call it the Toro Rosa. Roller. That's the easiest way. Anyways, um, that looked good. That car looked good. Nah, it did. It's it, just, it's a mirage. Even Daniel Ricardo said he's like, if we get a podium this year, it would be like a miracle. Right? He said they're a tenth place car at best. Is that what he said? That's what he said. Really? Mm-hmm. It looked good today. Yeah, but that team doesn't have any money. They're not, and they don't have a great team. They have a, they have half. They're half the size of the Red Bull team. They have half the budget of the Red Bull team. They're, they're the Red Bull Junior team. They're the Red Bull Junior it's team, which Zach Brown keeps complaining about. For you to do F two, go to the Red Bull, the Toro Rosso, then you're in the Red Bull. That's how the that's how they want to do it. Mm-hmm. And there's this huge rumor that your your Kimi kid. Uh-huh. I don't think this is a true rumor, but yep. supposedly Kimi. if he comes in in the top three or four, mm-hmm. 
in uh, F2 this year. They're just going to promote him right to the Mercedes seat, which oh. I, I don't I don't believe. I wait, think, wait, you mean I was right last no, week? No, I just said wait, it was wait, a wait, rumor. wait, wait. You wait, were right. I was right last week when I said that one Kimi Antonelli. They're not going to put him in the if car. I just said it's a rumor. Pay attention. If he wins F2, he'll be in the Mercedes. No, he'll be in the he'll be in the Williams. He won't. If he wins, I'm saying. If he, he'll be in the Williams. And he wins impressively. He'll be in the Williams. He'll At least be he in needs the Mercedes. One year of you know, Formula One. Mercedes is this team. They have this. Oh wait, <laughs> wait. Now that George is the team leader, or going he will to be, be the, the team, team leader. leader. They put Ant- Antonelli in there. How, how can he not be the team? It's like putting you in the car. Oh, I'd be better than that kid. I don't think so. I know. So. I think that kid would wax your butt. You're old, man. You're not. I mean, young I like wouldn't be able to, to do an entire Formula One race. <laughs> you're, 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 <laughs> I can do about ten. Out. I can do about ten laps, and then I'm going to need a break for about. You'd be three doing hours. the total WWE like tag, tag, tag out. Somebody else. Hey, get hey in. someone else get in the car. <laughs> I need help. No, it's I'd come, I'd come in here. Pit. Help I'd be, me, help me. After 10 laps, I come in. I'm like, it's over, right? We won. <laughs> we won. No, 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 Mike. You have another 40 laps to go. <laughs> what? No, Daryl Waltrip said that a few years ago. He's been retired from NASCAR for like 25 years. Yeah, and they were say? doing an interview about him. And he's like, I can go out right now and compete with these guys for about 10 laps. <laughs> and 10 I would laps. need a break. And then I would need a break. <laughs> Those cars are so hot. Sometimes they get up to 150 degrees inside a NASCAR. And then his depends would be full. Anyways, getting back to Formula One. So, what we're saying is, what are the worst cars? Really Give me the worst cars. What, what cars do you think right oh, now? Oh, the Haas is the worst car already. Well, okay, and what else? Williams didn't look that great to me either. I don't know about Williams. They their, their car looks pretty good, but I don't. I I mean, I don't know if they had, how much money did they put into their car this year. What about Alfa? You mean the stake Formula One team? Yeah, wh- what do you think they're going to do this year? Nothing. I mean, the only thing they got going for them is the overalls look cool, too. Oh, everything looks cool about the car. Yeah, but what do you but think the car... They don't, they don't have any money. They're not... A, they're, they're, the, they're a Ferrari junior team, just like the Haas team is a Ferrari Who's going to finish ahead? Who's going to finish ahead? What? Who's going to finish ahead? Ahead of what? Haas or Alfa Romeo? Well, since Alfa Romeo doesn't exist anymore, and it's called the Stake F1 team. Now. But you know what I'm talking about. Alfa... We're just going to call it the Sauber team this year, okay? Okay, we're going to call it Sauber. Who's going to... Stake... <sighs> I know, it's hard. It's going to be It's going to be a hard year. Stake, kick, Sauber, F1. Well, no, the Stake is a, is a is a gambling site. Well, I had a steak last night. No, no, no. You, it's, yeah, it's, you it's put a, gambling a little site. Yeah, pepper and, and salt on it. I can't believe it. you eat dead animals. Anyways. Oh, you don't? That's right. Before oh, I did when I was in, well, you were in Thailand. When yeah, I was yeah. in Thailand, my uh, yeah. my 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 new uh, yeah. lady friend, um, <laughs> she made me eat like uh, Japanese barbecue, and it was good. so good, right? It was good. Yeah, it was, you liked and it. it. Was a, it you was liked like, that barbecue. Check, check this out. It was a Japanese like high end like uh, barbecue joint, and they put the they put the uh, cooker in in between in, in on the table, so okay. you do all and the you, cooking. You do all the cooking, and yeah. you just order whatever you right. want as much as you want. Yeah, it was. Twenty dollars a person, and that was like high, 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 high end. end food. High end. If I would have went any place else, it would have been like five dollars. You know, I think I might have been wrong. I, I said that Lewis Hamilton was second. He's today. third. He's third. But he's he did have a better he's lap third. time than. But it doesn't. Is this the three tires? Is that the softs? That's the soft. Okay. So, then he did do at least one, um, fast lap. Yeah. We did a qualifying lap. But you don't know if their engines are turning. You so, don't know what they're doing. You have no idea. We have no idea. So Haas Except, is going to be in dead last. Oh, they, even the, the, their new uh, their new Gunther Steiner, the uh, Japanese guy, mm-hmm. said that they're going to they're gonna, they have the worst car. Why does this keep happening? With the Haas? Yes. Why? Because they don't have any money. But how did they come out when they, they first started? They only have like three or four hundred people working how, on that team. When they first started, did they come out like gangbusters? Well, because they had a bunch of the Ferrari junk on the car. Like so they, they, they still they, do. They yeah. still do. But it's like the car is built by Delara. It's not built by Haas. Okay. Which is the only car on the grid that's not built by their own team. And then they have an alliance with Ferrari to put all the Ferrari junk on their chassis, which is basically a copy of the Ferrari chassis. So quick rumor, or not even a rumor... A quick prediction, as soon as the new... The regulations? No, 
regulations. Not only, but not 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 talking about the regulations. But soon as Andretti has their new factory ready, Haas will probably sell the team to Andretti. Well, there's another rumor out there that Audi might sell the team to Andretti because he was in, in in the market to buy the team, but he had sticker shock on it, and Audi swooped in and bought it. But all the guys who who started the Audi Project. Formula One program yeah. don't work for Audi anymore. So. What? All the all the all the all the CEO and the other dude don't work there anymore. So, and so, it's like we're two years from the from the regulation change, and supposedly, J- I think James May, I think is his name, and he's the mm-hmm. uh, I think his name is James May. Yeah, you're right. That's James. And May. he's the technical director for the stake Sauber Formula One uh, money app, whatever the hell they call it. <laughs> uh, um. He says that they they're, they're not they won't be competitive that. till 2027. Okay. So and Audi thought they were going to swoop in because I think they're making their own engine right now. So, yeah. Yeah. Well, like, I mean, Audi's and then Porsche Volkswagen, was supposed Porsche. to have a team too, right? Even though they're under the same tent as Audi, but they were going to have two separate engines. Okay. Which is insane. It's and like, did, but did they back out? Well, no, they didn't. Porsche didn't do a team. So there's only Audi, but Audi, okay. The, the the two teams that could be purchased by Andretti because Andretti is all in on he's going to be in Formula One. I still have no idea what the hell happened with uh, the the Liberty people didn't want an eleventh team because it's up to it's up to them. It's not up to the team owners. They, they don't have really have a vote. But for, I, it makes no sense because the reason they gave makes no sense. Andretti has like like. <laughs> You know, I think he's owned that team for 20 years now, and they've won championships yeah, they won champion in multiple, multiple different series. And they're building a brand new $300 million factory in Indiana where it's going to be actually a car built in America where the base is in America. So, what do you think of Lewis Hamilton taking videos, close up videos of the Mercedes car? Well, because he's going in the back and going, well, this is wrong, this is wrong, and this is wrong. Ooh. So he takes the video of it, he goes to the back room, and well, he remember, talks to the engineers, and he's like, hey, look, you've got to fix this. I saw this on this well, car. Hey, this could work a little bit better. Well, that's the other thing about the new Red Bull. If you look at the new Red Bull, it looks like last year's Mercedes. It's just weird. It's strange. But they did it, but they did it right. The team, last year, they put the driver... A closer to the front axle, and right. Hamilton bitched about it the whole All year. All time, he wanted and to be back. If you look at the Red Bull, they have mm-hmm. uh, they have vertical inlets, right? Horizontal inlets, and then they have two inlets behind the driver, which I think helps cool the whole thing, so they don't need a they don't need as much cooling. But that they also said that they have these little op- open inlets to help cool the driver. And, well, everybody and knows that's it's, on, in, it's in front of the car. It's in, it's in, it's in, it's on the monocoque now. It's on the front. It's on the monocoque. Right, right in front of the some driver. Some of the teams have it on the front. They have almost, it on the nose, and right. some of them have it like right, right, right ahead of the driver. So, I guess that. Is, and ev- everyone's like, well, "What are those for?" And I'm like, "I don't know. Maybe aerodynamics might have something to do yeah. with it." Because remember, they can always take that inlet, the uh, the vent off. Okay. There's going to be a way for them to take it off, and then they'll have a smooth surface. So, you might not see that vent during qualifying, but you'll see it in the race. All right. Does Lewis Hamilton any of those video that that he's taken? I'm just he, being sarcastic. Does he press know. send and send it to Charles Leclerc? No, he's, <laughs> he's not going to talk to Charles Leclerc ever, ever, ever. He's got to. What beat, are you talking about? Talk to him all the time. He's got to beat Charles Leclerc. Now they're going to be fucking bitter enemies. What are you talking? You think about? so? Oh dear God, yes. The only reason he's so cool with uh, when he was so cool with Botas is because he was always faster than Botas. And he's he's sort of has an edgy relationship with uh, Russell because Russell's been bringing the fight to him, and he's going to go to Leclerc, who is uh, one of the best of the young drivers. He just has a hoopty team. If Leclerc was in the Red Bull, he'd be handing it to, to to Max. But I think Max is the best driver of his generation so far. So, but I, like I said last year, I think even if Nikita Mazepin. Was in the Red Bull, he would have won the championship. No, he wouldn't. Us. Have. He would have found a way to crash. Yeah. He would have found a way to. No, because they would have told him <laughs> miss, to slow down. That's why the like, gears. They would have put a rev limiter <laughs> on the car. Something. <laughs> they would have put an anti-spin something. device in the car. <laughs> he would have done something. So, did you see that they had another cover that came off, and they had a red flag? It Formula One has to do something with all these manhole covers coming off. It happened in Vegas oh, no, last that, that's year. That's happened a few it, times. It's so. happened. It keeps happening. 
that should be an area of contention where they go to these man well, covers. They have to have and man. They have, sure to have, they have to have a place for the down. water to go. So, but again, but no, they well all those things. Hamilton rolled over it. Then science rolled over it, and then they have to red flag it because there's a hole. Well, they're on all the track. well. They're welded shut, and these cars create so much updraft that it just sucks the thing off of there. It's gonna happen. Every, it's gonna happen every now and again. It's a, oh, look at the car. Yeah. See the things behind the drivers. That's the part I didn't notice. Because they had it covered up at the launch. That's a good idea because the it's going to help with the cooling. When you say the things, are you talking about outlets, inlets? What are you the talking about? The inlets right behind the driver's head. Those two square ones that yeah. are right there? Okay. That's going to help with cooling so they don't need to have as big of... Remember, every, the whole thing about a, a Formula One car is weight. So if you have a smaller radiator, you have less weight. Right. Um, and I think those are going to be... That's what they're for, there for is to cool the car. Okay. So... And if you don't, you don't want to put the live, live, you know the uh, you know the side things in the car like they have right there, the little levers on the side panel. Yeah, they don't want to put that there because that ruins the aerodynamics. What so. a slap in the face! What the ultimate meme if Red Bull can pull off what they already did with because okay, great Mercedes. Okay, ninety percent about the performance of these cars is from the floor, and the Red Bull obviously has the best floor. So all the junk they put on top of the car is. Maybe ten percent of the performance. It's not. It's not as. But much. definitely the that's, floor. And Red Bull wh- has the best floor. That's why Lewis last year said, "If you put side pods on the car, it's not going to do anything." And it really didn't do anything. They should have just stuck with their concept, and they didn't do that. And or, they just ditched it halfway through the season. It's almost like this year's car is the first iteration of 2022's car because it's a whole new car. So really, it's Both almost car, like all the, the cars. The Red Bull is a that's a brand new car. No, but I'm I'm saying that Mercedes concept since it's brand new, it's like day one for them. Mm-hmm. While the other teams are two years ahead because sort they're, of, they're sort on of. their own path that they've been using since 2022. Well, no, and, every, no, and every, that everybody has started all over again. Everybody in 2022 went to the Red Bull concept, so they except had, except Mercedes because they had the side pods. Yeah, but they couldn't. They couldn't. No they couldn't go to the. Uh, they couldn't go to that look and now they sort of have the undercut and everything and it sort of looks like a red bull but the inlets are different right but my point is is that it's almost like day year one for them while the other teams are on their third iteration of their of their concepts mercedes ditched their concepts so they're starting all the way back that's why i say they're probably going to be like the fifth fifth or fourth best team I, I, I i that's why i'm saying i don't think Anybody's going to beat the Red Bull. Well, I have we know no, that. I have no idea. It's a race for second. I have no idea who's going to be the next best, but it, it could be McLaren. It could be Ferrari. It could be Aston Martin, and it could be Mercedes because they're all seem to be real close in, in times. Mm-hmm. And if it wasn't for the Red Bull, we'd have a we'd have a real season going it, on. And can the FIA here? Here's a letter. I, I wish I had some like really good like music to play let me see if i have something dun, da, 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 yeah. we would be honored dun, da, 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 if you would dun. join us oh, that's what i did no i would build a go. great wall I'll and nobody builds walls music. better than me believe me and i'll build them very inexpensive the wall goes Pretty cool. I played that Trump music. I don't know why, because I was watch trying to they, find. I was here. trying to find some like starter in music to play to make the prediction that I'm a letter to the FIA. Well, I'd have some like really like Swan music playing mm-hmm. right now, like with a violin. Wah, Please wah, find wah. something on the Red Bull to slow it down, to bring them <laughs> back on into it. the pack, so we can actually have some good racing this year. I don't want to see another race of Max Verstappen. Max Verstappen. I don't want to see race after Max race after race after race after race after race of the same smug face of him winning. He's going to win all the races. I don't want to see it. I don't want to see that again. It's going to happen again. It's probably going to happen next year too. No! Their car is so Adrian! much... <laughs> Stop okay, Ro- it! Okay, Rocky. Hey, you, you, um, you know, uh, shout out to Carl Weathers. You know, he's a good man. Good man. Mm-hmm. There's no way that I can watch this again. How many races... And always rooting for who's going to be you second. You made me who's watch every second? one of these stupid races I last did. year. And I'm like, I kept like... I, I couldn't watch them all in one city and it was too boring. It was like... Uh, it's like 2004 again. It was it's, just like Jesus. This is like it's 
just I don't Mike, I can't do it. Okay, I this is this is what Formula One needs doing to do. It. Tell them. Formula One needs to this is what they need to do. This is the same stuff that we always talk about. Yeah, they're gonna okay. take, they gotta take they got they they gotta take the wings off the cars. They gotta go. take the floors off the cars. Yeah. They gotta give them super, yeah. super soft tires, let yeah, them refuel. Yeah. And then Red Bull and <laughs> it's probably still gonna win. <laughs> and and gonna they're win. still gonna win. They're still gonna win all the races. <sighs> well, We've talked about testing day two. Today, in the wee hours at 11 o'clock Pacific time, PM? PM will be testing day three. And then. Oh, it's 11 PM when it starts? Yeah. And right. then it's off to get ready for the start of the season. What's the first race date? The end of the month. I think it's the 28th, 29th, and the 1st. Matter of fact, I that I know it's it the, is. It's March first, really. Yeah. Well, there's 24 freaking races this year. There so. is. See, and they're you, going to they're going back you see, to China. I'm getting better. They're going back to China. I said freaking. They're going back to China after five why, years. Why, why are they going back to that? I never liked that track. It's a bitching track. What are you talking about? <sighs> there's always so much smog. Well, if you watch smog. it, the first, first so year they had smog. the race, it was completely clear. The next year it was pretty clear. Then the after year it was a little smoggy, and then like. One year you couldn't see down the straightaway. I can only imagine being at that race, like trying to breathe. Everyone's gonna have masks on. Well, that's why we're not. Fest. That's why we're not. Uh, we're, we're not uh, going to that race. No, I don't think I would ever go to that race. I don't think that race will be around that long anyway. Where's I mean, the? Tw- why is it say maybe they'll make a race in Hong Kong? Yeah, That'd be a lot. A mo- lot more okay. people go to a street race. In oh, Hong the first Kong. race is gonna be at Bahrain. Yeah. February 29th through March 2nd. So in, t- in a week. I, what did I say? That's what you said. I'm just oh, I'm just okay. I'm just confirming it. That's all. I wasn't dissing all right. you. Oh, okay. Right. It's it's a rare occurrence. Enjoy a while it lasts. <laughs> <laughs> well, we did a quick show today. We want to talk about testing, what some of our findings are, what some of the things Whoa. that we're seeing. And we're watching a, Logan Sargent. We're watching Logan Sargent do a 360. He, he hit a bump, he said. And, you know, it was good recovery. No, it wasn't. He ended up in the... He, 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 it was not, it was, <laughs> he didn't end up in the wall. Well, that's, that's a good point, but right. he shouldn't have crashed in that spot anyways. <laughs> Next week, tune in. Will we do... Are we going to do a preview? We're going to do a preview of the season. We're going to declare the champions oh, the first... You know what? What? Guess what comes on tomorrow. What? Your favorite. We're going to have to do some shows on that, too. What, NASCAR? No, no, your favorite. It comes on Netflix. Oh, shh. <laughs> <laughs> Drive to survive, everybody. I'm sorry. We'll be I, I, hitting I, I, the I, airwaves I, tomorrow. I've only seen on Drive Friday. to Survive once. I laughed the whole time because it's just a TV show. It's not. That's not real. So what we're going to do... Well, is, I'm not going to do anything. We're going to have a have to do a Drive to Survive review show. Yes, we are. Hey, did it. We did it last year. We're going to do it again <laughs> this we? year. Yes. All right. So we are going to do a Drive to Survive. We might even have a watch party. That'd be fun. Do you have Netflix, Mike? No. You don't? I have it, but I haven't. I got to rehook it up because my dad canceled us or something. Well, you know, we could do a Drive to Survive watch party. Um, like we can I, no, watch it. Tell you, tell you what, you do a drive to survive watch party and tell me about it. I'll do everybody. <laughs> we'll do a drive to survive watch party on like our TikTok. How about that? Let's go to TikTok on Friday. Am I, am I the actually most, on Saturday because Friday I'm working. Who's the most popular one on TikTok? Me. Really? That's I'm the, the most one popular there. on TikTok. You're the most popular Everywhere on Instagram. Yeah, fuck <laughs> off. No, on Instagram. <laughs> but Instagram and, and, and our YouTube shorts. We're about even. Oh, we're about even. We're about even. But you're you're the Instagram because you got the nice hair, you know, and you know you smile a lot. And I'm better on TikTok because it's you know more diverse and there's more people around the you world. You can't pronounce but whatever. I pronounce it really well. No, you don't. You say Max for stupid all step it step for stepping. You you don't know anybody's names. That's, that's <laughs> part of the stick, man. That's <laughs> part of my stick. stick. It's part of my stick. Hi, my name's Sherman, and I'm dumb. <laughs> Shut. What? <laughs> and I'm. But dumb. I win all these bets, and what so bets? I'm always right. I saw you three dollars. Yes, and I won it. 
matter of fact, it's four now because you found out that I was right about Kimmy Antonelli, which I told you I was. I said it's a rumor. And that's everybody not knows I'm true. Right. So that's they're four, not going to put him in the car right, next year and when that's he's eighteen zero years old. Zero being right for you. You're out it's of your really mind. Really hard for you to understand that. But Vettel is going to be in the car next on year. On that note, oh wait a minute, we'll be back for a review of Drive to Survive. Tell you what episodes to watch and what episodes not to watch. And what Mike hates about it, which probably will be everything. Just sake. don't watch it. Then we'll talk. We'll have a preview show of Bahrain, and then we're going to have a review show of Bahrain. They're going to so do that all in one of episode. Shows coming up. No, we got that's three shows. But we have a week till the, the race. So we have a show about Drive to Survive. We have a preview show, and then we have a review show. That's a lot. Everybody freeze. So. I got 46 days till Thailand, so that's all I really care about right now. I, I've decided that um, I think I'm going to go to Suzuka again. I thought you said you're going. I am going. My well, brother is going to meet me out there. It's going to be my fourth time. And yeah, the, the first race is next Sunday. Meet with some people from F1, obviously business trip. Oh, that's right. The race is on Saturday. Y- yes. Okay. Never mind. Not, it's not on Sunday because it's here. Yeah, but no, in it's, the United it's, States, it's Saturday. It's Saturday, yeah. maybe on because it's a night race. That's why because it's in Bahrain. You know, sometimes your brain actually works. But no, I thought it was on Sunday at night. Well, it's so. not. Whatever. It's on, it's Saturday, on Saturday. Let Back it go. Back to what I was saying, so we can go and eat uh, lunch. I'm I got. Hungry. I no, I'm not going to lunch today. I got to go to work. Oh, well. you're gonna have to go buy your own lunch today. He's always trying to get me to buy him lunch. I don't understand. Hey, you know what? We should have got a free lunch at the Warwick before you got fired. (laughs) That's a good point. (laughs) We should have got... I didn't get fired. You should have read the bill, They said they were going to suspend me, and then I quit. So that's completely different. You got fired, Mike. I I quit. That's what happens when you drink after hours. It was my one one day a week side hustle job that I've had for a year and a half. And the new GM, I guess, didn't like me. So whatever. That's all right. You're a likable guy. That's okay. I, I still have my my uh, my union. Uh, local You're really big job. in India. Huge. Are we big in India? No, we're not. But we do have people that watch us in India. Look at that car. Already has scratches India. on it. It's like crazy. All right, is that Keep on. Oh, that's twenty one. Racing. What the everybody. hell is that thing? What is that thing? Bye bye. <laughs>